In front of us, we have three light bulbs. Over here, this is a 60 watt incandescent bulb. Then in the middle, we have a 23 watt compact fluorescent bulb. And on the right, we have a uh, 8.7 watt LED bulb. Uh, the LED bulb, the surface of it is uh, not much more than room temperature. It feels maybe ever so slightly warm. In fact, the base of it is actually warmer than the uh, the bulb part. It just feels just a little warm, nothing to it. Uh, the CFL, the base of it, is actually uh, relatively warm. It's, uh, that's ceramic, feels pretty warm. And looking at the thermal scan, I can tell that the, uh, the CFL bulb itself is actually pretty hot. Um, I can touch it, but I don't want to for very long. Now, on the other hand, here's our uh, uh, incandescent bulb on the end. And if I get all three bulbs in the shot at the same time, uh, you can see that the, the white hot on the top, uh, that's very hot there. That's clocking in at uh, over what uh, this meter can read. Um, compared to the other bulbs here. Even the base of it, this is just the metal collar uh, that goes around the bulb, is fairly warm to the touch. I mean, this really radiates out some heat, and I can only uh, touch that bulb for just a moment without getting burned. So that's what a 60-watt incandescent, a 23-watt CFL, and a 8.7-watt LED light bulb look like to a thermal camera.